platinum blonde hair, ombre, and dip dye. They are among this year's hottest hair color trends. Mike Brookbank takes a look at how it's done around town. 2013 is raising the bar with its hair trends, going brighter, bolder, and more dramatic. You can make it natural or you can make it, you know, dramatic like what we're doing with you. What DJ, owner of Enzo's Salon and Spa, is doing is putting purple dye on our producer's hair. It's been really popular. And she's using the latest dip dye trend. I'm going to kind of feather my way up. That way she doesn't have like a hard line. So it looks like it kind of like is melting, like literally like she dipped it into color. But if you're not into purple, the whole ombre thing is real popular. Sometimes people will get, you know, up to like three colors and it'll kind of like just melt into each other. You may have seen celebrities rocking the ombre look recently. There really is no difference, honestly, in what we're doing, like technique wise. This is exactly what you would do for ombre. So what are DJ's tips to make sure your style stays looking great as long as possible? The longer you can go without shampooing it, the better. Use a color protect shampoo. You want to rinse your hair in like cool water because that helps close the cuticle. There's a new place to shop this Easter. Everybody's happy and says it's about time seasons in Ohio. Seas Candy just opened its first permanent shop in Ohio in the Beachwood Place Mall. We've been making candy for over 90 years. We believe in freshness, great quality, and customer service. But while Seas is new to our state, for some, their handmade Easter eggs are tradition. If you're from the West Coast, then people are aware that every year they have that tradition of our Easter eggs and Easter baskets. My favorite part? There are always samples. We love for you to sample. It sells itself. For The List, I'm Mike Brookman.